Well, it was like a second dream come true, you know? The feeling, I can't even explain it. Obviously, myself and the way my family felt, my mom actually achieved one of the hardest things in the world, which is play for Spain, which is the, I think every Spanish kid dreams of it, that likes football. That it was unbelievable. And obviously, then go to the camp and train with all these such a big players that you always have been seen on TV and being the best is just unexplainable, to be honest. Oh, obviously, it was quite strange for, I think, the Spanish people because obviously played 17, 16 games at the time. No one knows me really in Spain, you know, and then suddenly you just put this keeper on the list, which nobody knows. And then they maybe search me and then they're like, oh, he only played 16 games, who is this? So I think at the time it was a bit strange, you know what I mean? They were trying to find as much information uh, possible and obviously when it came out, um, some of the radios around the place knew my address, they appeared on my mom's door trying to ask questions. So yeah, I think, um, I think it was a pretty exciting but weird time personally for my family as well. Obviously, it's like the ritual that every new player has to do in the team. But um, the funniest thing is that in Spain, they never do it. And uh, after that, I spoke with Sergio and he said that they only st they start doing the songs about free collapse before the one I went, which was quite new. So it was quite unlucky for me to have to do it. But now nah, I was obviously quite nervous because the people I was singing in front of, you know, but I think after afterwards was pretty fun and I think it's a good memory to have. Uh, obviously I work on it with Ben and stuff, but obviously I like to be different as well. I think it's a different style of goalkeeping, try to be more proactive, which is not many out there. And um, I know how good it feels for myself when I take the ball from the air. I know how good it feels for the rest of the players, which is like a time to relax, keep I got the ball. We can relax now, get back in shape and play from there. And not naturally, trust me, I've done a lot of mistakes through the years. So uh, it's just a learning process and uh, just try to improve. And obviously, better to have a relaxed goalkeeper that can play with feet, but someone that's never wrecking and trying to do crazy stuff. So I try to always stay calm and then uh, just take the best decision with my feet.